And then all of a sudden, like, I start getting really anxious. Like, I'm like, I need to pick up the camera and I need to vlog, but anxiety's like, don't do it. Don't do it. And I'm like, why? Just don't. Good morning, internet friends, or rather, good evening, internet friends. How are we doing today? How are we, sassy girl? You doing tired? Yeah. So, I know it's it's super late right now. It's like 8.43, and I'm finally picking up the camera. Of course, most of my day has been spent interning. And then, I get home and, you know, lay on the couch because I'm tired. And then go downstairs, have dinner, deal with Riddler. He's feeling sick to his stomach for some reason. Um, come back upstairs, get a shower. And then all of a sudden, like, I start getting really anxious. Like, I'm like, I need to pick up the camera and I need to vlog. But anxiety's like, don't do it. Don't do it. And I'm like, why? Just don't. And I'm like, no, I need to pick it up. But you have so much you need to catch them up on, and that's just... Ugh! Brain, we still gotta do it. Okay, fine. So. I want to tell you, one of the most... I had a lot of anxiety today. Um, the biggest one was that... Okay, so, part of where I intern is in a building. And, of course, if you have enough people in there that are yelling, it's loud... And a school trip was there today. So a lot of yelling kids. And of course, it's a contained space, so it's really loud. Um, at one point, I had to clean out the center Fennec Fox exhibit. Which is basically, like, in the very middle of the room. Is where three of the foxes are. And around all the sides, except for the door, there is windows so people can see in. Well, I was in there cleaning, and I was, in at every window, there was kids and adults staring down at me while I'm, like, cleaning out sand, and it was really loud, and what people don't realize is that inside the exhibits, this is why, this is also why you don't need to knock on the windows at zoo exhibits. It is a lot louder inside the exhibit than you think it is. Knocking sounds a lot louder. And while the vo the many, many voices sounded kind of muffled because of the glass, it was still very loud and resonating. So it was making me really anxious and I pretty much had a like I pretty much had a panic attack right there while I was working, but people can't see it. Because, for all, all you anxiety people out there, you will get this. You are used to panic and anxiety attacks to the point where you can completely hide it. And look like you're completely fine when on the inside, you are falling apart. And the rest of the day, I had to be like, take moments and take deep breaths. Because, of course, throughout the day, there were still a lot of people. And crowds are part of my anxiety. And then, of course, I made a few mistakes. And tiny mistakes still make me feel like, oh my gosh, I'm going to, like, get a horrible intern report. I'm not going to get a job, blah 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 Even though I know that's completely untrue. But the anxiety brain is quite a wonderful thing. Not really. Um... <coughs> But that was most of the day. The afternoon was a little more chill. Um, and then left work, went and got a free Route 44 from Sonic, because I had one of those, like, you go online and fill out a survey, and you get a code to get a free drink. Which, I don't really like dealing with the surveys, but I really like free drinks. So, yay! And then got home, and I already told you what happened when I got home. 
So now I'm about to work on yesterday's vlog. I have a lot of clips from Lowe's that I need to put in. So yeah, just wanted to catch you up on what's going on today. Hey guys! There my little baby. Hi buddy. Though I sent a picture of him in his gear to his breeder and told her that he's not much of a baby anymore. Because he's working in public and losing his baby teeth. He can't be a big boy. And there's my sassy girl. So, I got the vlog up. That's exciting. I'm annoyed because there's three comments on it and I can only see two of them. Ugh. I wish I knew why. But it won't say why. But, um, yeah. I'm excited because tomorrow is Saturday and hopefully I'll get to sleep in if the dogs will let me. I'm looking at you, Emeril. But Riddler's just as much at fault. Yeah? Okay. I'm back. And we have the Riddler now. He's licking my legs because I put lotion on them. Do they taste good? I hope you're feeling better because you were feeling sick earlier. But you're not acting like you're sick. So now my parents are going to go and pick up my brother from Magic. I was going to, but I had just taken my Ambien right when they asked me to. And driving while under the influence of sleep medication is a bad idea. Don't do it, kids. <sighs> so now I'm going to sign off for the night and head off to bed. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've had a wonderful day or night, rain or shine, whatever the world has for you today. Question of the day is, what is one of the weirdest videos you have seen on YouTube? Um, I guess what I'm thinking about right now is, I mean, I've seen some weird videos just because they pop up. But today I got to see what happens when you put salt on a leech. I feel bad for that leech. Also, I have once seen what happens when you inject hydrogen peroxide into a full tick. Which of course people are like, oh that's horrible. But I'm like, ticks spread Lyme disease. That's bad. I would much rather inject them with peroxide. Um, if you don't know what will happen... If you know how hydrogen peroxide reacts with blood, it's that exact same reaction inside of a tick. So put your answers down below for really weird YouTube videos, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye! Good night, Emmerville. Good night, Riddler. Good night, Sassy. Good night, Internet friends. Good night, Raven. Good night. Good night. Woo!